Today we are getting back into writing because I have completely abandoned my routine. In my defense, I have depression. <laughs> and uh, also my kids were homesick for a week and a half. So yeah. Hey there, welcome to my channel. My name is Darian. If you are new, I am an aspiring author, a mom of two and a military spouse. Uh, who does social media by day and I am currently working on my fantasy serial series called When We Were Legends and um, I haven't been writing so that's why you're here, <laughs> right? <laughs> um, no, seriously though, I uh, have two kids and they are in full-time daycare but when they are sick it throws us all out of our routine so today we are getting back into writing. Now, I haven't done really any writing um, in over a week since my daughter got sick with hand, foot, and mouth. Um, thankfully, everybody is healthy and back to school, um, but I have not been able to get back into my routine because my mental health just hasn't been there. Um, so we are really trying today. Um, so all that to say, I haven't really been writing. I did uh, <laughs> randomly last Friday spend two hours writing a one page synopsis of an entirely different novel idea that I think is very commercial um, and I'm very excited about it. So maybe we'll start there, I don't know. Let's get on into the video. First things first on the getting back into our routine agenda um, is to work out because I thrive when I exercise. Um, so I went for a run this morning um, on a trail. It was glorious. I will insert some video that I took on my phone because um, I'm gonna do like a real series. Um, running for my stupid mental health so yeah did that so checked that off the list checked in with work i don't have a lot going on today so i am going to use this to find the muse get back into it capitalize on the time that i have and see where we go from there first things first i am going to get a shower <laughs> because i'm terrified of ticks so i'm gonna go do that now one of my goals for today is to finish reading Fourth Wing. I randomly picked it up on release day at Target because um, the marketing for the book, like the cover is just genius. Like, you know, shiny gold, I'm there. Um, <laughs> sprayed edges with the dragons, you had me. Um, totally knew nothing about the book, bought it because I read the synopsis and my husband went to a military academy. So I was like, this sounds right up my alley. Um, and I've wanted to write a like military academy fantasy setting novel um just haven't found the right idea yet so anyways i'm about 60 percent of the way through that i did finish legends and latte no <laughs> i did finish legends and lattes today um the audiobook who is which is read by the author who is a an audiobook narrator um so that was fun i'm glad i get to check that off my list finally um and i have finished my work for the day so those are things that we have checked off the list. I did also work out, so I'm feeling very refreshed, I guess is the word I'm looking for. I don't know. Um, so yes, that is where we are. I, okay, <laughs> goals. Here's how we're gonna get back into writing. We're gonna sit down and we're gonna write, right? That's all you have to do, isn't it? Um, so anyways, I'm going to finish that book today maybe hopefully <laughs> um i want to look at when we were legends what i have written so far um i have just over 10,000 words written in this project and i'm thinking i wrote them as big chunks but i'm thinking that it might be more beneficial if i break them down into smaller episodes um so if i break them down into like 1500 word episodes that's like six and a half episodes that I already have written um so I feel like that is a good place to start because that will motivate me um but before we do that I'm gonna go get a diet coke because I 
am craving a Diet Coke. I haven't had one in a couple days. Of a serious Diet Coke addiction, addiction in this household. Although we have been drinking a lot of LaCroix. The Limoncello LaCroix with a fresh lemon in it is so good. Um, so yes, that is the plan for right now. Welcome back to my office. It's been a while since you guys have been up here. Um, things have changed and that's because we rearranged things up here um, so that the guest space was nicer. Um, my mom just came to visit, so that was nice. Um, so yes, I have a new configuration in my office and I also have like a whole new setup. I'm a social media manager um, by day. So I have the Asus Pro Art monitor um, hooked into my um, MacBook Air and this keyboard that I got at Best Buy. <laughs> Um, so I really like it so far and I haven't really done any writing related stuff up here, but we're up here right now just because, um, I was doing things on the computer and I want to see the, when we were legends document in like bigger, <laughs> a bigger screen than on my iPad because my, the problem with the setup is that my laptop is tucked in there and plugged into the monitor um as well as the charger so i actually just went yesterday and bought a little keyboard for my ipad so that i can kind of take this with me on the go versus having to come up here and like unplug my laptop and all that fun stuff so yeah and then downstairs i just pop it out and put it in my little typewriter keyboard so the problem with this is that I don't really have any idea what I'm doing. <laughs> um, cereals is like so broad and new and like everybody does them a little bit differently I feel like. Um, and I've already had some alpha readers look at the first two what I called episodes um, that I said are like 5,000 words each. So I might see if one or two of them would be willing to um, read like a broken down portion and see kind of like what that looks like um i feel like to do this i might need to print it off and read it and kind of like look at it from like an editing standpoint um because if i broke these down into like six or seven episodes that would pretty much be like half of the season like the first season so I would want to make sure that the pacing is like really on point um so yeah this project is giving me a little bit of difficulty but not for really any particular reason other than like my own st stress um it's 2 p.m hope you're having a good day want to go for a walk thank you google I already went for a walk today <laughs> This is the problem that I keep having is that I just like sit down at my computer and stare blankly and I don't know if, if it's like I really don't know what it is <laughs> other than just like me being in my own head and being in my own way. Um, as I mentioned in my like May reset video, I um, really wanted to like refill my writing well this month and I don't know that I've done a very good job about like of that um I mean I've read a lot of books but I haven't really watched anything so I'm wondering if maybe that is part of the reason why I'm like struggling a bit um I've been watching a lot of YouTube and I've also mentioned this but like watching YouTube doesn't actually help me refill my creative well it helps me get motivated to write but it's hard to be motivated to write when you don't have any ideas um so yeah i have ideas for this story i know that i do i just don't know why they're not standing out to me um and like where i've set up the third episode the episode that i'm currently working on like I've kind of set it up for something to happen that I don't know that I'm ready to have happen yet. Um, which 
which is why I'm like struggling a little bit with how to format this story because you know I really want the pacing to be done well and right <laughs> for the story um, and there are benefits to having it closed like where it's like only one location right now technically two because the second episode um, is like following different characters who are somewhere else in the, the world um, so yeah I don't know I'm just in my own head maybe this is a sign that I just need to go read or do something else that is writing adjacent so I think what I'm gonna do now since staring at my computer is clearly just like not working is go through my notes that I have for this project um I kind of have them in like a couple of different places just like as the project has evolved um and so I want to go to like my original brainstorming document which is actually in notion um and I have a whole like video about my notion setup if you want to check that out um so I think I'm gonna do that and see if I can get any ideas generated um if that doesn't work I'm going to switch projects for a little bit um and see if I can gain any more traction on literally anything else <laughs> regular series, whether it be a dynamic series or a standalone series or any of those types of series that I talk about, is usually made up of novels. So I still haven't done any writing, <laughs> but that video was actually really helpful because it made me think about the questions that people will be asking as they are reading this. Um, so I think what I'm going to do is read through what I have so far and take notes of all the questions that people should be or might be asking themselves just to see how engaging the story is. Um, so yeah, I'd like to get this episode, this third episode finished before I do like any sort of like editing um but I also don't want to do a bunch of work and then have it not be where we need it to be you know so I'm gonna take a break from the computer and I'm gonna go have a snack and read fourth wing <laughs>